morning. First night sleeping in the van was amazing. Uh, I feel amazing right now. Slept like a baby. Yeah, I felt really good just to actually be late, to lay down completely full. Yeah, I made uh, those 33 days of Hotel Camry well worthwhile. I feel like I really am grateful just to lay down like this. So, you know, I don't need a platform. I don't need some wooden board to make the surface super flat. I mean, everything's flat enough and good enough with my, um, I think, four to five inch of memory foam insulation. So that keeps me nice and warm. Uh, this morning, I think it's probably like 28 degrees or something. It's still below freezing every morning which is so cold I don't care if it's zero to, if it's not zero degrees anymore <laughs> 28 degrees is still pretty cold when you wake up gonna get the day started sunrise over the mountains this is probably like one of my favorite parts of the day just a sunny day hopefully it's like 40 some degrees and melts all the snow and the sun but yeah just looking at the mountains seeing nature in the fullest you know not just living by one mountain just like a whole mountain range everywhere you look always <laughs> So, once again, uh, last night went really well. But yeah, I'm trying to tint these windows out, but it is six windows, and three of them are super big. So I'm looking at like 300 some. It costed 230 to do my five windows of the Camry. I do have a 25, I think $25 certificate for the place I got them at, um, because they took so long last time. Uh, but yeah, once I get these windows tinted out, preferably, the same tint I had on the last ones, which is 15% on the front, 7% on everything else. Um, I should be good. Uh, I'm not working today, although I am gonna go pick up a check, which is good. So I'm just gonna organize things, just like the first few days, first week or so of Hotel Camry. Just a lot of cleaning, reorganizing, trying to make things perfect. I do wanna go to the library too, and I, I really haven't watched too many van life or van dwelling videos. I watch Element Van Life, Cheap RV Living, a few other van people. But as far as like Element Van Life and Cheap RV Living, they're like the two really proper van dwellers. So I need to just study some van life, van dwelling videos because I really have no, I, I've been studying for a whole month and just experiencing myself how to live in my car. This is like a whole new experience, you know? So I want to see if there's, I want to see if there's some sort of layout or setup I could be doing a little better. See what everyone else really needs and has in their car or in their van. Um, once again, just super thankful that everything went down last night. Still amazed. Uh, I just need to crank it up uh, with the work factor. I'm applied to a few uh, jobs for possible second job. And yeah, just excited. Excited to work a lot. You know, for me, honestly, working while you are without a house and you're just like dwelling in your vehicle or whatever even if you're just like crashing at a friend's place for a certain period of time um it's important to just stay busy you know right now it's not too warm to like always be out recreating you know being at work is for me it's warm it's a great social aspect helping others you know with your job seeing people be happy uh I do a lot of cleaning and stuff at work. Just whatever, just staying busy for like anywhere from a few hours to eight hours. And then with two jobs, you know, hopefully I'm working like 10 to 16, 20 whatever hours a day if they need me to. But it just like, as soon as you're done working, you only have so much to do, you know, eat, maybe read a little bit, you know, maybe watch some videos on Netflix or YouTube, maybe go to the gym and shower and just go to sleep. You know, the days are kind of made for you when you're working a lot. So yeah, that's basically the plan today. I just want to let you guys know that I did survive the first night and just to put something up, uh, you know, definitely try and get your financial system uh, situation underhand. Uh, make sure your life's organized. So that's basically what I'm doing right now. Uh, but not too, not too, uh, worried about the second job situation. Staying positive. To get out of Alaska, I'm gonna need to make as much money uh, as I possibly can by September. And worst comes to worst, uh, I'll just leave with what I got and just start new somewhere else. <laughs> Peace. Hey, so I'm just uh, chilling at a park. Today has been a pretty chill day. I went to the gym for about an hour, just did some cardio and a leg workout. 
So I'm feeling pretty good. Getting a lot more used to my Vibram five finger shoes, which is really nice. I feel like I'm building a lot more strength in my feet, walking in these all the time. Um, right now I'm just eating some <laughs> pineapple and I just did uh, some dishes. because I'm about to eat a uh, organic chopped salad. These are only uh, $4. Also got some single serving silk dark chocolate almond milk. And I've been really trying to uh, be on an easy digestive diet. As you can see, got some fruit, salad, some almond milk, got some applesauce. I'm almost out of peanuts and uh, granola, so I got some cranberry trail mix. Wanted to treat myself to a high quality uh, noodle meal a little later. I'll uh, probably like tomorrow or something, uh, but I got this. And uh, this is vegan as well. You know, I was trying to eat healthy, stay healthy, stay fit. You know, I got this car, yeah, I got this uh, van, but you know, everything moves on. You know, I gotta keep the same routine going, keep the positivity and uh, healthiness going. And I'm actually off for the next few days, which is nice. Kind of worked out perfectly getting this, and now I'm off for a few days to just really just relax and organize stuff. I've been organizing stuff a lot more. I'll give you another view of uh, how things have been after the first night. So I'll give you a quick tour of the current status. Got my five fingers chilling. Forgot to mention too, this uh, one pound bag of multi-grain uh, Cheerios. Cheerios is awesome now too because they're 100% uh, gluten free. Let's look at the back. So um, we got my car seat. That's like a miracle bamboo car seat that I use. Really has been helping with my posture. And it's also cool to just sit on if I'm in the back. Yeah, I got the bed right there. I did some rearranging. Kind of works out perfectly right now. Um, as you can see, it's kind of a little messy. Got 2.5 liters of water right there. Water for days. But yeah, I also use this cajon as a table if I need to for my laptop or just to set my Bluetooth speaker. But yeah, pretty chill, you know, and um, I'm still just reorganizing things. Yeah, just chilling. Right now, it's just super comfortable. No complaints. Just chilling here in this uh, pretty chill park. Might go and take a walk later or something. But yeah, peace. Day 35. Living in my van, complete.